Alright, pick it back up. Where we left off. Look at this guy's little bone arm. Arm's been missing. Oh, yeah, come towards come towards the light. I wanna hit I wanna hit me a zombie. This kid is just fucking Is this kid gonna have to kill this fucking other kid? Gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. <laughs> we'll be fine. We've gone through just as much as anybody else. This one's gonna grow up quick. I already am. I'm already growing up, he said. <laughs> Lee. Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? If you get that off his face, my hands are full here. This motherfucker is gonna die. What am I supposed to do? Why am I crouching down all weird? Oh, this. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? Uh, you mean the blood from him fucking dying? Why are we trying to save this kid? He's a lost cause. He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. Please what? Go fucking... Can't you run up to the front and tell it you're... Uh, I guess this dude is kind of a douche. This is, shit's really gonna hit the fan now that this kid fucking dies, dude. Cause this hillbilly dude with the handlebar mustache is the biggest dickhead out of them all. And once he finds out his kid's gonna die, it's gonna be like... Fucking shit show. I don't trust him anyway. Let alone if his fucking kid dies. The it's your son? Kenny. What? Ken. What the hell's that? Your son's blood. Get out of here, man. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. Oh, fuck. I'm sorry. I shouldn't talk like that right now. Go back there and tell my wife everything will be fine. You what is the goddamn deal? Stupid fuck. He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. <laughs> Stop the train. Yeah. Stop it, goddammit. Fuck you, man. Oh, yes. Yeah. Or what? You gotta see your boy, dumb fuck. Calm down and... How the fuck do you calm down after a day like today? By talking to your friend. I'm not your friend. Think you're the reason Duck was bitten? Like you had this coming or something? You need to just get over it. Fuck, man. Uh, There's no yeah. room anymore for feeling bad about things. Bad shit's gonna happen for the for the rest of our lives. It's just the way it is. So stop the goddamn train. Yeah. Took a lot of convincing. Just Kenny with his fucking handlebar mustache is a <laughs> such a little dickhead. Handle it. We handle it. Stop this fucking train. Now we get to see what kind of shit's gonna happen. Now this kid's gonna be all fucked up. What? Now, this is gonna turn. Ken, it's. I think it's time. Yeah. The boy's been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. Uh. Take as long as you need. There ain't no time left to take. Yeah, you know. 
Where is that fucking salt lick or whatever that you dropped on the old man's head? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if, what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But no. No. Come on, Cap. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Could just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Oh, fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. God, you fuck. I, I can. I'll do it. I can do this. I'll do it. No, it should be a parent. No parent should have to do something like this. Lee's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Well, I'm a convicted killer, so... So Clementine doesn't have to see. I'm a convicted killer, so don't worry about me, folks. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. Uh, I like how, like, much drama goes into this little shit from down. I didn't like the kid from the beginning, but the fucking homegirl gets just blasted, like, like, randomly, and it's super shocking and jarring, and I was not happy about that. But this little kid's like, it's like such a big emotional moment. But I didn't like this kid from the beginning or the family if it was up to me I would take this train and just leave what do you think is happening duck is dying I know He's a brave little kid what are you doing I'm putting him out of his misery. Oh. Oh. Jesus. Yeah. She goes, oh. Clint. Things are... What the... No! Ben, take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. What the fuck? Shot the gun. and Where was the gun? Did that crazy bitch catch up to him? <laughs> oh my god. This is crazy. What the fuck is gonna happen? Oh, who shot who? What, 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 what the fuck? What? The mom killed herself? Cat! Cat! Oh, gotcha! Oh my god. She couldn't do it, huh? What? Why? Cat! Honey! Oh, fucking god! Oh no. <laughs> this guy just got fucked. <laughs> what the hell happened? What did you- She couldn't- she, 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 oh, 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 fuck! Oh, now you have to fucking pop her in the face and the kid. Jesus H, man. You don't want him to turn. Or do you? See, this is what they should have done for the fucking old man. I don't know why they didn't wait longer. And there's no way I could have controlled it in the game to make it wait longer as far as I... I... Um... You're his dad. You gotta do this. Just put an end to it, man. Fair. What they do in the show, the kid takes care of the mom. Major spoiler alert. I guess you're supposed to yell spoiler alert after, or before, not after. You spoil some shit. He just left, dude. You just fucking gotta pull the trigger, man. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. Yeah. Fucking. You better shoot the wife now. He's gonna. She's gonna bite you in the leg. This guy's a fucking train wreck now, dude. It's gonna just be me and the chick after all this shit. 
when all is said and done. Because this guy's going to go fucking crazy. And you're not going to kill your wife? She didn't shoot herself in the head, did she? I guess it makes it look like she did right there. But the way it looked like when you walk up to her, it looked like it was on her shirt. But God damn. This is some fucking crazy shit, man. You get emotionally vested in these people and then they die. Not that I was emotionally vested with those guys because I didn't really give a shit about them. But I'm still stuck on a Carly chick. I don't think she should have died. It wasn't right. And this Ben kid with his two homies. I don't even know what the fuck. Nobody asked him if he was okay that his homies died. Uh-uh. You, uh, understand what happened? Yes. Okay. What do you think is about? What Chuck said. What Chuck said? That what happened to Duck would happen to me. The fuck he did? Swear. Sorry. <laughs> Swear. Don't be mad. What the fuck? I just throw this guy off the train. Hey. How you doing? How you doing? I don't care what reason you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Because she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. But y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? We do what's best for Clementine. Oh, well then, you do have it all figured out. Never mind. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... How the fuck well, are we gonna hash it out, dumb shit? If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. She's a little girl. And she'll die a little girl if you treat her like one. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. <laughs> so this is like an old dick faced Joe like over here. Not, that's what saves your life from here on out. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job, but too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. Except for you told her she was gonna die. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. Jesus. Sorry to hear that. No one to blame. Alcoholic? Where are you headed? Uh, that way. That way. When we get to <laughs> Got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. Alrighty. You're homeless then? Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and well, they just don't work out. That's fair. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. Got any? No. Darn. <laughs> Fucking alcoholic. Kenny ended up shooting his son out there. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. Be safe up here. You betcha. Don't need any bugs. Uh, well, I guess he's not that evil. But the little girl's probably scared shitless. I don't want to talk to Kenny. It's just me, Kenny, the little girl, and the dude now. It'll be good to get to the water. Still want to get a boat? It's still the best plan. Yeah. It's the best plan. Unless we have a plan. I guess I should have fucking told him that. It's full of maps and documents. Mind if I get by you for a second, Kenny? 
Can you just leave me alone? <laughs> Fuck. I can't even get the maps. Yeah. Are there any maps up here? I don't know. Just leave just me alone. Want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah? Those dickheads not gonna get me. Mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. <laughs> this guy's a fucking little cock fuck. About my past. Talk to you about keeping my past from you all. Doesn't matter a lick to me. Fuck. Just gotta move forward. Welp, it's been real. See you later, home slice. Can't believe I left that little kid back here by oh and the fucking guy that guy's here too. I don't care about this kid. Hey Ben. Hey. Carly didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. Aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless, homeless dude, dude. If he sticks around. Are you going to be able to step up? I can do just as much as anyone else. Good. I hope that's true. See ya. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck. Okie dokie, Smokey. Alright, we'll, uh... Talk to Clementine in, in this episode. Getting kind of a long episode here. Hey, Clint. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay. What should we do? Well... We're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and uh, tidy up a little so you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. Good. Well, alrighty. You need to learn how to protect yourself. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Probably the... Line up the sight. A lot of very... Is there anything else I should know? Jesus Christ, aim for the head. These are just bottles, but you have to aim for the head. I know, only the head. Unless it's not a walker and it's someone trying to hurt you. And then? Head or body, anywhere. Oh, fuck. I don't want to think about that. You're right. <laughs> it might be a lot for your first day. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Don't waste any ammo. You're gonna shoot the fucking bottles on the on the fucking moving vehicle. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly, and I'll cover your ears. You're not gonna tell anybody that you take your target practice here. Nice and easy. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah. <laughs> you do. Eek. Came left. Came a little bit more to the left. Keep it steady. Oops. Now keep it steady. Can't see shit. Aim a little bit to the right. To the right. A little lower. 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 I got it. Excellent. Good shot. Nobody cares. They're just shooting shit up back here, huh? Now behind the back. Am I really doing this still? Where the fuck did it hit? A little bit more to the left. Okay, a little higher. Oh, Jesus. Aim more to the right. 
little bit low. Oops. Oops. Oh, uh, how about aim up? Steady now. Almost got it. Aim a little higher. There we there go. go. Nice. That's what I just said. Are we fucking doing this again? I think she got it. Stop wasting the fucking ammo. How many of these motherfuckers do we have to do? Oh, okay. I did it! Yeah, you did. Good job. I just pretended they were walker heads. Good. Nice. Just like you should. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. I feel good. Not so good. scary, huh? Nuh-uh. Except she's shooting my fucking hand off. Jesus H. Alrighty, we did it, America. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and stop it here. We'll pick it up in the next episode. God damn it, 20 minutes.